So if you are going to a very important meeting, grab the keys and just going to start the car and this happened. You know the problem, the battery is dead but what can you really do about it? Maybe call a mechanic but it will waste a lot of your time. So in this video, we are going to charge a dead battery in just 5 minutes or less than that. So let's do it. For that, you'll need a switch mode power supply from old PC. So you can get 12 volt DC quite easily. But if you charge the battery with 12 volts, it will take a lot of time. So we will need to step up the voltage a bit, 14.2 volts to be exact. For that, we will going to use this DC to DC step up converter. It needs cooling while charging a battery with a high current. So use this fan from old PC. Next thing, you need a voltmeter and a current meter. But this guy right here need to switch probes and change the knobs while measuring the voltage and current. So this panel meter comes very handy because it will show you the voltage and the current at the same time. And lastly, we need two 10 ampere diodes to prevent the reverse current flow. The connections are very simple. Take this connector removed from the old switch mode power supply and connect the positive yellow wire and the negative black wire at the input of DC to DC converter. Then the red positive 5 volt wire goes to the power of the panel meter. The negative wire of the panel meter connects to the negative of the DC to DC converter and the yellow wire from the panel meter is our negative output so current will flow through the panel meter. Now connect two 10 ampere diodes in parallel at the positive output of the DC to DC converter which ensure that no current will flow into the DC to DC converter. Now the last step connect the red voltmeter wire to the diode output and connect alligator clips for easy access. But right now I don't have this so I will just twist the wires tightly around the battery terminals. Now grab the charger, plug it into AC socket, set the voltage to 14.2 volts and wait for 5 minutes. If the charging current is dropped below 1.5 amp, you can start your car and go. Or if you are in hurry, you can always start your car instantly by directly hooking up this charger along with the battery. Well, it's better to spend a few minutes to charge a battery by yourself because you can always save your time by increasing the acceleration. Just kidding. Drive safely. So if you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button below and subscribe for more videos like this. And there's always thanks for watching guys. Peace. Goodbye.